What is going on guys, Rewinds here, and in this video, we're going to be having a little discussion. If you guys haven't heard yet, the Boruto manga is going to be going on a three-month hiatus, and that pretty much starts next month, so the series won't be coming back until August 2023, and that means that the chapter itself will come out around August 20th of 2023, maybe the 19th, but over here it says the 20th, so I'm going with that. Um, but pretty much some of you guys may be wondering, why are they doing this hiatus, and is there a chance maybe Boruto could change format? I saw some people commenting about that in a few of my previous videos, so I figured why not discuss what could be going on. So, for the format, so I don't think it's coming back as a different format. I personally would wish that if it were possible that they could somehow make Borto bi-weekly that would be awesome if they could do that um, I don't think Borto will ever become weekly though bi-weekly I feel like they have a chance of pulling off just because we had these other um, Naruto uh, spin-off mangas that we just got recently such as the Sasuke uh, Retsuden one about the novel and then the, uh, the Steam Ninja Scrolls ones as well so the fact that we got those in manga format and we were getting them every other week means that maybe, just maybe, there's a chance they could go that route. Um, however, uh, I wouldn't get our hopes high for that. I think more than likely so, Boruto is going to remain a monthly manga, at least as of right now. If something does change, I'll definitely be sure to cover it, and I'll definitely be happy if they do decide to put out more than just one uh, chapter a month. But um, uh, as of right now, there's nothing to really point towards that. So sadly, we can't get our hopes high for it. Um, but also, it says the next chapter releases on August 20th over here. So that also just proves that, hey, it's going to stay monthly unless they wanted to start doing a different format after August 20th. But that should take care of that little concern some of you guys may have had. Nothing confirmed yet, more than likely so, will remain monthly. So that's pretty much that. Um, so why are they going on this hiatus? Some of you guys may be asking. So um, if you guys have taken note in general anyway, uh, in a lot of these other weekly mangas or just shonen manga in general, um, nowadays a lot of mangaka like to leave off on... A pretty big cliffhanger and they'll go on a one week two week break but that'll be mostly weekly mangas um, this is really interesting because the Boruto manga doesn't really go on hiatus like that we had one month I believe last year where um, the Boruto manga was on hiatus but for the most part Boruto has been pretty consistent so the fact that we got three months of a time skip happening means that there's definitely got to be some stuff going on behind the scenes so this really, I feel like, has to be Ikimoto and Kishimoto gearing up for the time skip. It's not for sure guaranteed that the time skip is going to begin next chapter, per se, but the way chapter 80 ended makes you think that there's a chance that if it doesn't begin next chapter, that it'll begin really, really soon. Me, personally, I'm hoping that we get to explore a little bit more of Boruto's escape as well as you know um him and sasuke on the run in general perhaps them building their relationship up again with the whole master and pupil thing even though the memories have been altered um as well as a few more other things going on around in the whole world i feel like if we do get the time skip coming into chapter 81 um it could be good and it could be bad uh, it could be good because, well, everybody's been waiting for the time skip. Everybody would be excited and hype. But it could also be kind of iffy or bad because I feel like one of the coolest things they could do instead of just giving us the immediate time skip is at least showing us um, Boruto and Sasuke on the run for a little bit. Um, they could definitely also do the time skip and maybe flash back to that as well throughout the time. That's always another way. But I feel like them on the run would be cool to see and I definitely want to see everybody else's reaction in the village as well um, such as Shikamaru's maybe some older characters like Kakashi I want to see the reaction 
of I, I really want to see them bring back a lot of the older characters we also got to see the reaction of like sakura here and we didn't even see himawari last chapter and i'm saying sakura because i mean sasuke's her husband so she must be wondering like hey what's going on and i want to see um some people's reactions to naruto's supposed death a little bit after you know things have calmed down so hopefully we're not going directly into the time skip but um, we definitely are close to that. So I feel like they are gearing up for that or they're gearing up for something big here because it feels like the phase of what's going to be happening in the Boruto manga is going to be changing more ever since especially these last few chapters. So all in all, um, I definitely think that that plays a role. And we also got to keep in mind that the anime is also on a hiatus right now as they're gearing up for part two. So I'm sure behind the scenes that Ikimoto is helping with that because he is involved with some of the anime stuff. For example, the Kawaki Himawari Ninja Academy arc. I know he played a role in, in the involvement of that one. Um, but I feel like uh, just a lot of prep is going behind, behind the scenes right now. And um, I would say 50-50 chance that maybe next chapter we'll start with the time skip. And if it doesn't, then I'd say the other 50% chance is we're just going to get to see Boruto and Sasuke on the run for a little bit, which is something I'd like to see. Um, but all in all, um, that's pretty much it for this one. Um, that's kind of the main reasonings of what could be behind this hiatus, because I don't think it's really anything like production issues or anything like that. Um, Ikimoto, although... He's lacking assistance. He does a pretty solid job for the most part. I do think there's some times where I feel like the fights could be better in the manga. But he's definitely improving as it's gone on, um, in my opinion. And um, hopefully if Borto um, is coming back in a different format by some chance, then maybe he will have some assistance to help out or more assistance um but even if not let's say it just stays monthly it'd be nice if he uh has some extra help just so that we can get a better looking manga and so he could get a little bit of more assistance in general and other aspects too like getting opinions on the story um but that's gonna pretty much wrap up this one if you did enjoy the video be sure to hit the like button subscribe to my channel if you guys are new hope you guys have a good day or night whenever you guys are watching this video i'm rewinds and i'm out